Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you my everyday simple makeup routine. So I'm going to begin by applying my tinted moisturizer. I'm using Tarte's Amazonian Clay BB Tinted Moisturizer. It has an SPF of 20, it's oil-free and it's antioxidant rich formula without parabens, mineral oil or anything that may clog your pores. I prefer this over foundation for during the day because it looks very very natural. So now I'm going to cover any imperfections and uh, for this I'm going to use uh, the Amazonian Clay Concealer and a lot of you guys have been asking why I use Tarte a lot is because their products are natural and they're formulated without parabens and mineral oils which clog your pores so this is why I like using them. Next I'm doing my brows. I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Deep Brow in the shade Chocolate. I'm usually in uh, the shade Ebony but during the day I like to use a lighter shade which is chocolate so I'm going to use her double-sided brush to brush my brows in upwards and sideways motion and then I'm going to fill them in using the cream I'm not gonna exaggerate them too much I'm just gonna follow my natural shape and um, because I want them to look more natural and less noticeable and drawn so once I'm done with the other side I'm going to seal it in place using her uh, clear brow gel to keep my eyeshadow in place I'm going to apply primer I'm using Tarte's um, 12 hour creaseless primer and then I'm going to seal my um, tinted moisturizer in place and the concealer using uh, max mineralized skin finish natural my shade is light and um, real techniques multitask brush I don't apply much eyeshadow during the day, I like to keep my look pretty simple and natural. However, I like to apply a little bit of eyeshadow because I want my eyes to stand out. So um, I'm using Bobbi Brown's Velvet Plum number no. 3, it's a metallic eyeshadow. And I'm just dabbing it on all over my lid using a MAC 239 shader brush. Next I'm going to take a fluffy blending brush and the shade Cork by MAC. And I'm going to apply it with circular motions into the crease and this will be my transition color and will warm up the crease really well. If you hear anything in the background, uh, there's rain and heavy thunder. At the moment there's a big storm in Tanzania so it's pretty scary. So if you guys can hear it, sorry for that. Now I'm applying the same shade cork on the lower lash line to warm it up. Next I'm going to take the shade Bone by um, Bobbi Brown and I'm going to apply it on my brow bone to highlight it. To make my eyes appear bright and fresh I'm going to use that same highlight color and apply it on the tear duct area and then I'm going to take um, Inner Rim Liner by Tarte and line my waterline. Then I'm going to line my lids and I'm gonna keep it very very thin and a small baby wing what I call it just to define my eyes a little bit you can skip the step but I like to do this instead of lining my whole uh, lid with this I'm just you know doing the corner of the eye now I'm going to curl my lashes and apply some mascara and you can apply false lashes if you want to I don't wear falsies every day especially during the day unless I have an event to attend or anything you know that I'm going to be taking pictures or you know whatever that is Otherwise, I just use mascara. So I'm going to load my lashes with mascara and apply some on the lower lash line as well. And then I'm going to apply some bronzer. I'm using Physician's Formula Bronze Booster. And um, I like it because it's, not, it's pretty light, so it looks kind of natural. It's good for the day. So I'm applying it using Real Techniques Contour Brush on the sides of my forehead and the hollows of my cheeks. I tend to stay away from powdery blushes for the day so um, instead I'm using a cheek stain this one's by Tarte it's um, the shade is tipsy it's a peachy coral shade and it matches my lip stain that I'm going to use later on so as you can see it's very very um, voluminous and it gives you that natural glow next I'm going to highlight my cheekbones and I'm using Max whisper of guilt it's also a creamy texture so it's perfect for the day 
I'm applying it on the bridge of my nose and my cupid's bow as well and now I'm going to line my lips and the shades I would normally wear every day are peaches, corals, peachy nudes, um, light pinks I try to stay away from dark lipstick or um, really pale nude so these are my favorite shades and I don't really wear lipstick a lot or lip gloss what I do wear are lip stains so this is the final look guys I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you got inspired by it and I hope that you're going to try it this is my everyday simple routine sometimes I skip the eyeshadow altogether and I just apply mascara and um, I keep my lip bright so um, if you like the video don't forget to thumbs up and if you have any suggestions or any comments you can either email me or leave your comment below thank you again for watching and for supporting me always and god bless you bye